Well, the chance is here for the Gulf Coast to watch our local police, firemen, and EMT paramedics battle it out on the court and all for charity. Joining me now to tell us more about the Guns and Hoses Pickleball Tournament is Thomas Lindenberger. Thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you for letting us come. Of course. So tell us a little bit about how this pickleball tournament came about. Okay, we have, we have a good contingent of pickleball players on the coast. And about a year ago, some firemen joined us from Biloxi, and they started playing. And it really spread through the fire department. So we had quite a few firemen that loved to use it as their wellness and their fitness program. And we had this idea about raising money for their charities. Uh, uh, we got the police officers involved, and, and now we, uh, we find it uh, as uh, really an interesting combination between cops and, 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 and firemen. So we call it Guns and Hoses. Uh, it was a nice catchy, and we've, uh, the tournament is tomorrow. Uh, we have 96 players. Um, 45 or so are, are first responders. Some of them come in as far as Baton Rouge, as well as Slidell. They come and join their brothers here. And we also have some pickleball players that have shown their allegiance to either the police side or the fire side. And we're, it's really a bragging rights for the trophy. And we've uh, been fortunate. We've had some very generous sponsors. So we've been able to raise quite a bit of money for their charities. The police officers is a, a, for the torch run for Special Olympics. And for the firefighters in Biloxi, it's for the Bucks for Bicycles at Christmas. All right, so it sounds like a really great cause, and people can, of course, come out and, and support all the people playing pickleball, and, um, and tell us a little bit about that. Please do, because we're, uh, it's an opportunity to learn about the game, because it's spreading quite fast. So uh, uh, come on out. We'll, uh, you can observe as well as we'll have, uh, there'll be lunch served out there that you can, uh, and, and it'll be a good time. All right. Well, thank you so much for joining us. It sounds like so much fun. If you want to come out to that event tomorrow, all that information is up on your screen.